The reality is that Kylian Mbappé last summer signed a new deal at Paris Saint-Germain, but until June 2024. So it was a two-year extension with an option for a further season. That option is only in the player hands. Hey guys, Fabrizio Romano here, as always, to update you on the transfer market. Today we have a breaking news. Today is a very big one. Kylian Mbappé communication to Paris Saint-Germain. Let's jump into it together on all the details of this crazy story. Maybe the story of the summer. <music> And so guys, Kylian Mbappé, news of the day, it was reported by L'Equipe and we can confirm and enter together into the details of this story, this is a very big one. So get ready because there are many details of this story uh, which are really, really important to understand what's going to happen. What happened, guys? You remember that Kylian Mbappé extended his contract at Paris Saint-Germain. Uh, it happened one year ago when uh, Kylian Mbappé uh, communicated to PSG that he was going to sign a new contract. It was a big surprise. He was close to Real Madrid, but he decided to stay at PSG. But in that moment, Kylian Mbappé goes on the pitch at the Parc des Princes, the stadium of Paris Saint-Germain, with a shirt with the text 2025. The reality is that Kylian Mbappé last summer signed a new deal at Paris Saint-Germain, but until June 2024. So it was a two-year extension with an option for a further season. That option is only in the player hands. It's an option until June 2025 that only the player can trigger. And there is a specific deadline for that option. August 1st of this year. So Kylian Mbappé, by the end of July, has to communicate to Paris Saint-Germain what he wants to do with the contract. This is the point. He has that option. He's on Kylian Mbappé. He can decide whatever he wants. What happened? That on Monday, today, Kylian Mbappé informed Paris Saint-Germain that he's not going to trigger that option. So that his contract is not going to be extended. At least the current one. What's the point? Paris Saint-Germain are really shocked with this situation and with this decision of Kylian Mbappé. For many reasons. Paris Saint-Germain are shocked because Kylian Mbappé had a lot of time to do that. Maybe in July, maybe in the next weeks, not now. Why so early? Also, Kylian Mbappé uh, has shocked Paris Saint-Germain because from club side, they are convinced that they were preparing a new contract proposal. So Mbappé had the opportunity to extend his current deal until June 2025, but Paris Saint-Germain, to be ready and to give Mbappé what he wants, they were preparing a new deal proposal, longer contract to Kylian Mbappé, to discuss with Kylian Mbappé. And they were not expecting his reaction like this. But also, from Paris Saint-Germain, they feel that the news was leaked to the media before communicating to the club. So they're really surprised also with the timing. They're really disappointed with what happened with Kylian Mbappé. But there is a crucial point, guys, on this Kylian Mbappé story, that now Paris Saint-Germain position, from what they understand, is very strong and very clear. They don't want to lose Mbappé as free agent in summer 2024. This means sell Kylian Mbappé this summer or sign a new deal before next summer. Now Kylian Mbappé has to communicate again to Paris Saint-Germain to understand what could be the next step of this crazy story. But the first step was made for the player. He had the chance to stay silent because there is a crucial point that they state uh, around uh, this negotiation. Kylian Mbappé didn't have to communicate on a legal point of view this decision now and not in any case. If Kylian Mbappé was silent until the 1st of August, it was automatically not renewed the contract of Kylian Mbappé. But he decided to communicate that. He decided to communicate that to Paris Saint-Germain and this is why the club is really upset. There was no need to do that. So this is now a really complicated situation. Paris Saint-Germain look furious about the situation. Kylian Mbappé with this move is now to consider one of the potential names for this transfer window. Paris Saint-Germain were planning for a transfer window with Kylian Mbappé into the squad, so signing a center striker to allow Kylian Mbappé to play on the left, but now everything could change because Mbappé could be on the market. We know the big connection with Real Madrid. We have to see what's going to happen also in England. You remember maybe one year ago, Kylian Mbappé revealed that some English club was approaching him before he decided to extend the contract with the PSG. So many things could happen around this story. We have to be careful. We have to wait. I will update you in the next hours. But the breaking news today is that the situation between PSG and Mbappé is again very, very, very tense. He communicated that he is not triggering the option to extend his contract. And so now his future looks really open again. This is a shocking situation. We will comment on Real Madrid and much more, but this is the point between Mbappé and PSG. Everything has to be decided now. New deal, so new negotiation, not triggering the option. New negotiation, otherwise Mbappé could be gone this summer.
And so guys, let me know your thoughts on this Kylian Mbappé story. Where do you think he's gonna play on the 1st of September? I want your prediction. Hit in the comments, remember to like this video, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to the channel. See you soon.